memory games from when we were kids and a lot of apps have a memory game element but not like this one. Carissa Christner, a children's librarian with the Madison Public Library is here with her bi-weekly app recommendation and today's featured app is Fita Match and we were saying that this is a German yes. word. Yes, a German so, name. Fita. And this is a great example of an early literacy skill that we've talked about. We've got a, a graphic that shows that. And mm -hmm. this one is for play. Exactly, because this is a classic game. And like you said, there's a lot of apps that do include a memory game, but it's usually sort of an add-on. And it's really usually just a grid of a bunch of um, things, and you're playing against yourself. What makes this app really special is that you're actually playing against this little sailor kid here whose name is Fita. Fita. And he's a character that shows up in, in their whole series of apps and uh, let me tell you a little bit about okay. how this works all right so he's on a on a lighthouse here and you can see that in the little different windows are a couple of different ways that you can choose to play the game so I'm gonna start from the bottom to show you here are two that exactly match yeah here are two that match but they're more like symbolic uh -huh. um, here's one where you've got like one statue from Easter Island and all of Easter Island oh, so this is cool. all about like different landmarks that mm -hmm. are from all around the world here are two sort of related pictures so and it then gets more it difficult. gets more complicated as you go up then they've got some uh, mathematical equations and then some just like quantities things so it also includes some stem learning which is really nice yeah so um, really quickly let me show you too that in the parents section you can choose how many cards you use in your game so you you can choose a short game like this, how difficult it is, and whether you want to have the sound on. Okay. So with those settings, let's play a quick game. I'm going to show you in the, the semaphore flags. Um, so what I like about this game is that you'll see Fita here, and he shows us some real nice genuine emotion of what you might feel as you're playing a game with anybody. Um, so yeah, like he's impatient because we've he been is. talking let's too much. Let's keep going Come on, here. pick a Ready card. Ready to play. All right, so I'm going to pick these two cards, and oh, they don't match. They're going to get flipped over, and now he gets a turn. And oh, he remembered. <gasps> so he got the match. Now he and gets he's another excited. turn. Yep. So let's see. Oh, he didn't get a match. Oh, now let's see done. if I can remember. Oh, no. Oh, I didn't get a match. Now he gets a turn. He's going to try that one and that one. Oh, he got a match. Good for him. Now he's, he's cheering, but he's not rubbing it in. Yeah, it being... actually shows pretty good sportsmanship. Exactly. And that's one of the things I like about this. Now, now, in this game, he won the whole thing. But the last time I tried it, we got half and half. Here okay. you can see his stack. Again, he's cheering. Hooray, I won. But he's not, like, jeering or making you feel bad about yeah. it. So I like it because it gives ki uh, parents a great opportunity to talk to their kids about how to have good game etiquette yeah um, and I also think it'd be a really awesome entry to actually playing a physical game of memory with your kids and if you don't own a game um, I put a couple of links on the app recommendation page that yeah. I have on this review um, to some free printables that you can print out online your own memory game just oh, with paper great. and a printer and try it at home so then you can do the digital world yep. version and the version that we all learned as yep, a kid. Exactly. Great. Thank you so much. Again, this app is called Fita Match. Mm -hmm. And if you would like to check out Carissa's entire list of app picks for kids, she just mentioned that the one for this one does have that link to the traditional memory games. Just go to NBC15.com, click on News Links. We'll be right back.